Hi, Keith. How are you? Yeah, not too bad. Sorry to spring a little this on you. Um, I'm just going to run through your list of your martial arts, and then I'm going to hand over to Phil, okay, if that's all right? Okay. So, uh, Mr. Keith Cook, uh, 50 years in martial arts, five times world champion, trained in China, uh, karate, wushu, taekwondo, competitor of the year, 83, 85, and 86, ranked the most influent martial artist of the year by Black Belt Magazine. Uh, and obviously uh, a whole list of movies that you went into as well, action martial arts movies. Um, I'm just going to hand over to Phil here, um, <coughs> Keith, um, just to give you an introduction to Phil. Okay. He's a nightstand black belt by three different um, associations, 54 years in training, world champion in 96, European champion in 98 and 99, uh, ranked fourth in the world, also a bodyguard to the stars, uh, Whitney Houston being one of them. A uh, world record breaker in 98 and uh, been teaching since 1980. So, uh, uh, Phil Morton, I'll hand over to you, please, mate. Hello there, Keith. Hi, Phil. How are you? Yeah. I'm not so bad. I'm, I'm sorry for this impromptu um, uh, visit. Uh, Lee asked me and he put some something past me a couple of days ago. Um, obviously, we, we, we probably have a little bit in common, apart from you being a massive movie star and me just being me. Um, but we've we've done martial arts most of our life. I'm 64, um, 64 last week actually. So um, I think we're on the same sort of level ground and everything. Um, Ali run something past me a couple of days ago, and he said, "Would it be kindly enough to do?" So recognizing people's martial arts and skills, and uh, obviously you're, you're a, an amazing martial artist in Karataka. Um, so in my own little humble way. Uh, I'm a ninth done a traditional karateka. I've done it for 54 years. Um, I don't mix my martial arts, but I train, train uh, different people. I train police officers over the years and cost protection. So my background is is a little bit different to yours, but I've still did, uh, kept in with uh, tradition. So with that in mind, I'd love to honour you, or I'd love to have the honour of presenting this to you, which is your sixth stand. Wow. Um, this is a mock-up of it because we're going to get the real one out here. The real one is uh, A3 and it's in colour. Um, it is sanctioned. It will be signed off by myself as a ninth dan. I am a recognised ninth dan, so it's not just like a, a piece of paper. There is a lot of thought coming into it. This is my bar at the bottom of my own little garden. With me, I have all my, my world championships. Um, I've competed... Uh, Kumiti, so it's proper Kumiti I've trained at and Kata. Um, so my my ninth dan was awarded to me back in 2021 after 50 years in Karate. Um, so I'm trying to just spread the word and uh, basically recognise other people in my own humble way from here in Manchester in the UK. I was very proud to uh, present Cynthia Rothrock, her ninth dan, um, and Lee's asked me to award you your sixth dan. Um, I mean, looking at your your your, your past district, uh, Keith, you should be at least a ninth dan yourself. Um, you should be because you put the hours in, you put the dedication in. But um, I hope you accept that on my on my behalf um, and with the blessings of you know, it's coming from a karateka karateka to a karateka. Well, I'm I'm uh, I'm very uh, honoured. Thank you. I, I appreciate that so much. He, oh. he's, you know, it's uh, he's, he's it's quite surreal, really. Um, you're such a, an amazing martial artist and um, film star, and you've done a great deal in, in your career. And for, for just a, a simple karateka like me, myself, um, to present this to you is an honour in itself for myself. Um, and I'd love a picture of you, uh, with you, with your certificate. I got an amazing one from Cynthia when she was awarded hers. I should have gone to America a couple of weeks ago, but we had a family bereavement. Um, oh. My wife's mum passed away. Oh, um, so oh. that was um, a, a month ago. We only buried her last week, so I couldn't make it to the States. But Jesse Bowen from the Mars Arts Association, mm -hmm. he, he did me proud and he actually awarded it. So thank you. And thank you, Lee, for um, giving me this opportunity to, 
to spread what we can do with the martial arts and to recognise these amazing martial artists. Yeah, well, well done, Keith. I just thought when we spoke the other week, you, you should be so much higher than you are. Um, <laughs> so I, I just had to do it, I'm, a, I'm afraid. I hope that's okay. <laughs> well, I appreciate it a lot, Lee, and I really enjoyed our interview, like I, I said in the email. I uh, thought it came, came out so nice, you know. You did such a nice job of editing and everything, too. So it's really good quality. Yeah, it's great listening to your stories. I really enjoyed it. All right, thank you, Keith. I won't, I won't let, nick you any more of your time. I'll let you go. But um, well, I'm touched and honored. Thank you so much. You're very welcome. Please enjoy it and, um, you know, continue with your great work. And maybe one day when I get to the States, we'll, I'll come over and do, maybe I'll do a little bit of training with you. Awesome. That'd be awesome. Yeah. Bless you. Okay, stay well. Keep well. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, Thank bye. You very much. Bye. Thank you.